Hey everyone, Mashy Matrix here, bringing you another Let's Play of uh, Twilight Princess. When we last left off, we collected a few of the lights from our In this episode, we are going to continue. First, by entering in here. So, we enter into here. <laughs> Fire. So we will light this. So we'll kill off that guy. Which will give us one of the lights. Which we will then collect. What? Ooh. Enemies. Three more places, apparently. I'm just gonna keep heading up. I'm not actually going to go anymore. Up here is important. Another point. Right now, not so much. Let's break through. And it's that easy. And look at that. We have our way out. This way. See that one went in here. So in we go. I've got to hit forward. Ooh, blue root. 
you the first time we found one of those. Things going down. And boom! Look at that. We even managed to kill all three of them. I don't suppose there's any nicer way to hunt these things. Well, you have to sacrifice someone's host. Find tears of light. That's how it is. So I'm going to collect the three tears. There's only one more set to go. There's four more. to go in. Ow. Alright, so we got this one. We still got three more to go. Hmm. We need to find these last three, don't we? This area. <coughs> so we'll jump off here and head in through here. Let's see what's up this way. But I can get you up if you want to go. Yes, I do. Climb up. Oh. Ugh, why do I have to stand guard? The ladder is destroyed, so it's not like any humans will come up. What is with the elders? If we have a problem the humans can help with, we should ask. It is better than suffering for the sake of pride. Last three are. myself on these things. I'm thinking a lot. Ooh, look at this.
go. because they think I'm useless. Oh, I was starting to have fun. Don't forget the fuse shadow. Hee <laughs> hee, see you later. You 
you are the one from Ordon whom these children spoke of? We are well met. I am Renato, shaman of this town. And this... This is my daughter, Luda. The beast took us and left us to die, but Mr. Renato found us. At first, I couldn't believe they had come from so distant a place as the Ordona province. Yeah, I... we don't remember much. All of a sudden, everyone was captured, and then... Until now, it's been like... A nightmare. Yeah, it was like a terrible dream, and we couldn't wake up. Mm, nightmares are everywhere these days, it seems. This village has certainly seen a share of recent hardships. Dark beasts attack, and even worse was a sudden and explicit change in the mountain dwelling Cordon tribe. They had long been our friends, but suddenly treated us as foes. Even now, they refuse to mer permit us to entry into their minds. It strains the limits of belief to think that such a gentle and proud tribe could change so suddenly. It makes me wonder if something in those minds is the cause of this change. In any case, you must take these children and flee this village before more nightmares descend. I, of course, cannot leave my village in such time. There is no telling what may happen to us here. But it is my job to try and coax the Gorons back from their recent change of heart. And with that, we are going to end it off here for today. I forgot we had this. Anyway, we're going to end it off here for today. Uh, in the next episode, we are going to do the next part, I believe. Do the Gordon Village, uh, go up there, see what's wrong, see if we can fix anything. Until then, I will see you guys later.